Hey, thanks for joining us at Silver Television News at this time. I am Adiso Omoroan. I will begin the news at 7 from Borodo State, where the Nigerian Air Force has destroyed a Boko Haram logistic base in Tumbu, Guinea. The Air Force, in a statement signed by its Director of Public Relations and Information, a Vice Marshal Olatukumbo Adeshonya, says intelligence, surveillance, and reconnaissance conducted by the neighboring Nigerian Air Force identified several vehicles and equipment belonging to the terrorists. The Air Force, after receiving the alert, subsequently deployed its Alpha Jet, which degraded the terrorists, setting on fire equipment found at the location. And as its 54th anniversary celebrations begin with the Jumat Prayer in Abuja, the Nigerian Air Force is asking Nigerians to show more dedication to national development. The Jumat Prayer was held at the Air Force Base Mosque. Correspondent Amadi Ui reports. Gathered at the Air Force Base in Abuja, officers and men belonging to the Muslim faith convey to commence the 54th Air Force Day celebration. The chief imam of the Air Force Base Mosque, Group Captain Lukmon Lawa, says it's an opportunity to offer special prayers for Nigeria, its leadership, and personnel of the Air Force as they fulfill their obligations to the nation. It's a, an annual event, as you all know, and uh, every year we welcome visitors and those of us who are Air Force personnel officers and men uh, to commemorate the existence of the Nigerian Air Force. He also urged Nigerians to show more dedication to national development. We are using this medium to tell everybody in this country that this nation called Nigeria is a trust equated on us by God Almighty. If we make it fine for all of us, if we mar it too bad for all of us, hence we should guard jealously on what we say and what we do. From Abuja, Amadi Ui, STV News. The rampant uh, cases of 